and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. I'm anxious to get started here, Brad. Hi, folks. I'm Bob Shaw, physical therapist. Brad Haney, physical therapist. Because we have the most famous physical therapist on the internet. In our opinion, of course, Bob. Fixing sciatica. Don't forget the nerve floss. So in almost all cases, nerve flossing is kind of an adjunct therapy. In other words, we want you to do the McKenzie program. Right. So in other words, go to bobandbrad.com. You can Google it and look up McKenzie program for sciatica treatment. Sure. That's the main treatment we want you to do. But quite often, this nerve flossing can help kind of take you, take you over the finish line. Yep, it just makes it complete. And I've had some people where this worked and the McKenzie program really didn't work as well, believe it or not. And unusual, it, though. Very yeah, unusual. and it may be because there's some scar tissue. Right. And the disc itself is not herniated or bulging, so you just it was it, it was down to scar tissue sure. there. So. So, by the way, if you're new to our oh, channel, please yeah. take a second to subscribe to us. We provide videos how to stay healthy, fit, pain-free, and we upload every day. Oh. Uh, also, if you get a chance, go to thebobandbrad.com. Go to the giveaway section. We're always giving something away. This week, we're giving away the... Booyah stick Booyah. right here. Booyah. Oh, I hit you, didn't I? I'm tough. All right. Uh, it'll also be the contest. will be pinned to the top of the page on Facebook. Mm -hmm. Uh, go to Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok if you want a 60-second version of our program. Say no more, Bob. So nerve flossing. It's, it's, you floss the nerves just like you'd floss, use floss to glide through your teeth. Right. So we're trying to help the nerves glide better. And often what it does, I don't think they really know what, it, what happens, what, what, why it works well. Well, there's some theories. There's but, theories, yeah. right. But it can desensitize them. So they, they're, they're not as you know as sensitive to pain like any movement because uh, some nerves i mean you you can do very little and it fires up your pain sure so we want to make it to the point where your pain is going to reduce and that it won't fire up so easily right if you think of the nerve that we're flossing uh this is not exactly how it is but uh as an analogy if the nerve starts in your big toe runs through your foot around the back side of your ankle all the way up into the back and connects up to the back of your yes. head think of that as a string and we're going to try and move that string together by specific movements of our head and feet and it's not difficult a little bit at first but uh we'll work you through it yeah it's kind of interesting we're actually putting the nerve on slack up here while we tighten it down here right and then vice versa yeah. is that yeah, so you think of that that whole nerve is just flossing going through your body. And it's not a lot of motion, but a little bit, and that's all that's needed. It's flossing as it goes through the uh, vertebral, the vertebral, the foramen. That's foramen, the, right. Which is in your spine. I Oftentimes, I think that's... The holes in your spine. Yeah, the, that's where the scar tissue, I think, is most likely right, to occur. Right, right. Or on the disc itself, I sure. think. But, um, yep. So you got to be very careful with this because it can make the pain better, mm -hmm. but it can make it worse. If you get too aggressive. Right, right if you get too worse. Or some people, it just makes it worse. And, and so mm. the first day, you're going to do 10 repetitions. We'll show you how you do it. Um, and we're going to see how your body reacts. If the pain, if it increases your pain, I want you to wait a week, and I'm going to show you what to do then. Okay. And we'll, we'll show you that after we, we've done this. We're going to wait a week before we video it? No, no, no. Oh. Let's, let's, let's get started here. So <laughs> this is all one repetition here. So let's say I'm going to do, you're going to do it from the side, yep. Brad. Which leg are you using? Uh, the left. Okay, I'll use the left too. So you're going to extend the leg at the same time you're extending the neck. And when you extend the leg, you're bringing the toe towards you. Toes towards the nose, I all right. remember and, it. And then you're going to go down. And I'm going to put the head down, and the toe goes down, too. So from what you can see here, you need to have a high surface to do this on. Right. Now, Brad is shorter, a little bit shorter, so he can – I'm actually still hitting my feet here, Brad, with this. I'm only eight inches shorter than you, Brad. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so you may need to do this, like, on a tabletop or – you know, also, I got to be able to have your leg go underneath it. So there's right. a lot of specifics here. Make sure you have a good, solid table to sit on. So let's go do one repetition again. You go up. You extend the foot. Extending the knee, bringing the foot toward you, extending the neck. Then I'm going down. I'm bringing the neck down. I'm bringing the foot down. Bob, I just want to add in, when you go down, this is unusual for us, but we're going to ask you to round your back Oh, out. sure. 
Um, so you flex and round the back, which is bad posture, but for flossing, it's acceptable. Sure. Again, coming up, extend everything. Coming down, flex everything. Up and down is one repetition. You're going to do it 10 times. That's Go ahead. Go ahead, Brad. I just wanted to say, particularly when you pull your toes up and you're stretching, if you feel an uncomfortable stretch, but it doesn't feel like a muscle stretch, it's it's irritating, but it's not muscle. It probably is that nerve being stretched yeah. a little bit. So don't get too aggressive when you feel that. I can specifically feel it when I get to here. It, it hurts in here somewhere, but it's not a muscle. I can tell it's... It probably is the nerve on yeah. you because you have a little bit of that. Yeah, I got some stenosis. Stenosis going yeah. on there. It's it's really strange. The mechanism of, of the body, you know, you know, the body loves to heal itself. And it's amazing how it, it actually sends out little macrophages that go in there and eat away possibilities, that, like eat away the scar tissue. Yep, takes takes care of the bad things. And yeah. The body, like you said, always wants to heal itself. So you're only going to do this 10 times. Then we said you're going to wait and see how your body reacts. If the pain got worse, you're going to wait a whole week, and then at the at the end of the week, you're going to try this first. Well, um, how long do you wait? Like that day or the next day or? The next day. I, I would say how, how you did over the next day. About the next 24 hours. Yeah. If you're the same, if it, it you really didn't make any difference, you can continue to do it then. Sure. You can do it every day, one time a day. Sometimes it can take a few days to help, mm -hmm. sometimes months. So, so I would keep doing it. If they're doing 10 of them, and by 7, 8, or whatever, all of a sudden, it starts to feel worse and worse and worse. Stop. Because that's a red flag. That Not means stop. give yep. it a break. Yep. Yep, I would. So it's a week later. It hurt the first time. This time, what you're going to do is actually start by lying down. This is how the McKenzie method starts, actually. You actually start by lying down for a bit, and you might even get up to this point. Prone on elbows. Yeah, prone on elbows maybe for five minutes, and then try the, the uh, flossing. Okay. So we're doing a little bit of this, kind of preparing the body right. to see if that made a difference uh, before you do the flossing. If that's uncomfortable or painful, then you better not right. continue with that either. But uh, you just have to see how it goes. The, the McKenzie is system is a whole process. Like if you watch some of our videos where we go through the entire process, we actually start you on pillows even. We have you right, lie down, right. couple pillows underneath you if if it's uncomfortable to lay, lie flat on, their, on your stomach without sure. pillows. And then we take the pillows away, then we lay on our stomach for a while, then we get up on our elbows, and yep. then we start doing uh, elbow press-ups. Sure. So all those, this is, again, an adjunct th th treatment. In other words, you do it in addition to the McKenzie. Right. We almost always want you to do the McKenzie treatment because it, that's usually where the one that's the most helpful. Right, right. And, and just remember, there's going to be a certain popular number of you people that will be like me or less, some of us with stenosis, and you'll find that nothing's working here, and maybe it is a sciatica from stenosis, which in that case, you should watch one of our videos on uh, exercises for lumbar stenosis. Spinal stenosis right. or for spondylolisthesis. You, you, right. you could be getting it from there even, too. Exactly. I mean, yep. So... All right, remember Brad and I can fix just about anything. Bob, I got to tell you something. I, okay. I got busted. We got busted. Last By who? Time. By my wife. Oh, no. What did she see? She saw the video with the snoring. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's about ready to have us delete that. She was ready to take care all of All the people it's helping. I know. Her, that's what I said. She was okay with it. It took me a while. Settle her you down. Brought it to, you took her away from the edge of the cliff. and, yeah, and She's she, okay. So she's she, okay. Yeah, it's a good video, she said, but maybe I should I'm use... surprised you didn't run the buyer first. I no. think I'm silly. <laughs> I knew it was good. He's a man. A <laughs> man don't run <laughs> things. Think of that. Well, anyways... No. Uh, yeah. All right. Well, I'm we glad can, you're still intact. We can fix snoring, you're still, but not a broken you, you, heart. You're yeah. still a, a marital unit. I hope I've, she doesn't see this a lot. All right. Either. <laughs> Take Thanks care. Thanks for watching.